Hello friends, uh, welcome again and uh, this is my new project online e-learning portal and uh, I have developed this project in PHP and MySQL. The version I am using is the PHP version 7 and the MySQL version is 5.6. Also I am running this project on the latest jam server but if you have the WAM server then you can also run this project on the WAM server. For frontend I am using the HTML, CSS and JavaScript. Some of the jQuery library also I am using like uh, uh, you can see there is a slider running on the home page and use i am run creating this using the jquery also for form validations creating of the uh, integration of the date calendars i am using the jquery so this is all about the technology so let's start with the functionality go through so the project title is online e-learning portal and i have developed this project in php and mysql also this is a mini project which contains only and only admin functionality. There is no uh, student functionality available in this project or there is no other login is available in this project. There is no registration inside this project because this is a mini project, right? So you can see there are a lot of courses available on the home page. So you can see this is the courses. Currently I have added uh, 12 courses. So if you want to add more, then you can add the courses from the admin panel. So suppose if you want to search the course, just click on the, just enter your course name here after it, that course will be filled out here, right? Once you click on the image or view detail section, you will be able to see the details of the course. So you can see there's a course name Java and what is the duration six months and the beginners, computer science and course author by Amit Kumar. Or this is a uh, content about course descriptions. So once you click on the start learning, you will be able to see all of the chapters. So this is all about the Java. And after that, there are five chapters available in this course. So you can add any number of chapters inside the course also from the admin panel. I will show you. So once you click on the introduction chapter one, then you will be able to see all of the topics available in that chapter one. All of the topics of introduction to the Java. And this is some content about that chapter. So you can see there are seven topics available inside the, uh, there are seven topics available inside the chapter. Once you click on the topic, then you will be able to learn the things. So you can see this is the content about the things, right? So this is the, this is all about the functionality. So once you, if you want to, so I have added contents only on the first program. So you can add any number of chapters in any number of courses. Right, so click on this start learning after that you will be able to get the chapters and after that topics and you will be able to see the details of the topics right this is the outer section also this is a static page i'm not saving the data of this uh, into the database it's coming from the normal estimate page this is a all courses which i have already this uh, shown you right and if you want to search then you can search it from here so you can just enter the course name after that you will be able to find out the details of the course this is the login and this is the early admin login this is the contact us so i am logging as an admin so this is the dashboard of the admin right so what the admin can do this is add course so course name duration level type author once also the image the icon right so once admin add the course after that admin can choose the chapter from here course here and enter the chapter in the title after that admin can add the topics inside that chapter so here is the chapter and after that he will be able to enter the content of that chapter right this is the report part so once you click on the course reports you will be able to see all of the course report also you can find out the course from here suppose if you enter the php then you will be able to find html this one java then this one right also you can edit or delete the contents from here right so this is the uh, course reports again this is the chapter reports so this is all of the chapters which i have added so currently i have added uh, chapters in the java that's why it's showing only for the java you can add chapters in any of the course this is the topic report so all of the topics which is available in that chapter so you can see these are the topics right and you can edit and delete it from here this is the my account section from where admin will be able to update his account details 
and this is a change password from where admin can edit and change his password okay so the above menu is total session driven if you log out then above menu will be gone right so you can see the above menu is not coming right so you can see the above menu is different so this is all about the project online e-learning portal the normally the main concept for developing this project is for uh, publishing the content uh, about the course in, in can break up it into the chapters and the topics right also this is a mini project which has only and only admin functionality so this is all about the project if you need more functionality in this project just put it into the comment or you can whatsapp and email me also and don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest video updates on the latest technologies thanks for watching the video thank you very much